Hi everybody, it's Mike Marco speaking. And this video, I'm going to go over how to take your Power Network viral blogging system, your blog, and put your own banner in it. Now, in a previous video, I showed you how to create your own banner using Power PowerPoint. So now that you have that banner, I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do in order to upload it to your to your uh, blog. So first thing I need to do here is I'm going to go I'm, I'm inside the back office for Empower Network and I'm going to select in here view edit my blog clicking on that okay it's going to take about a half a second here there we go okay and it goes to my default my blog so here, here it's still logging in here it's going to recognize that who I am because I'm still logged in you can see here I'm actually rendering a video. I should, probably should have waited before shooting this, but I'm a little anxious to uh, to shoot this for you guys. Okay, so now that I've recognized who I am, I'm going to click on the plus. And what that's going to do is going to open up the entire upper menu. So you can see here that it's actually, you, you can use the default Empower Network uh, banner if you want. But I really like to try to customize things. To really give the website a really good feel to what I want. Oops, got an error message here. I guess I got too much running here. That's okay. I'm going to make it listen to me. So as I was saying, here we go. All the options show up. What you want to do is you want to customize it so that way it can look look pretty good and and present however you wish. If you go ahead and um, and have this set up, you can make it customized to wherever you want to look. First of all, I'm going to do is I'm going to switch over to another blog that I have here. This one here. This was a blog that I created a while ago. It's my dummy blog. Kind of just where I can do a little testing. So I'm going to let it switch over to that. And so, so you can see here, this is the original Empower Network uh, banner. What I want to do here is, first of all, I'm going to hit the, I hover the mouse over this. It shows up the edit upload image. And I'm going to choose a banner. That will work perfect for this. So I'm going to select this one right here. And it's thinking as it's uploading the uh, new banner. And there you go. And what you can also do here is to create a title for it. We can call it in this case here Powerful Money Magnet or whatever you want to call it. Put it in where now this is where you can put down where you're going to click. If someone clicks on this banner, where it's going to send them. In this case here. I'm going to send them to my main capture capture page, um, yourmoneymagnet.com. Okay, and everything's set up to go, and I just have to hit save. So I'm not going to do this in this particular case, it's just my dummy one, but that's how easy it is to get everything up here. Now you can see here, it, 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 it scroll down here, you can see the different kind of images you can um, put in. You can put a JPEG, okay, uh, you can put in a PNG, BMP. And this is the size. It must be at least this size. Now, what you can do to do that is, I would go when you create the PowerPoint or however you're going to do it. I make it slightly bigger than this in pixels, so that we guarantee the size. But you keep the aspect ratio. So in this case here, in a previous video, I said um, I use like for instance 9.6. In this case here, I put 9.65 and 2.7. That will guarantee it's, it's going to fit in here. Okay. So that's it for now. I will talk to you later. Bye.